Congratulations, I got a real bitch. Dead homie. Congratulations, baby. You got your man. We lower got a big boy of Van Dome. Let's go. Fuck. I hate that I have to speak out, but I have to speak out. Krishan Rock is a fucking genius. I'm not going to take that from her. I'm going to tell you why she's a genius. Because she's, she's, she knows how to manipulate. So she manipulated me to thinking that she was all about me because she was out of desperation, right? So that's why when she got into a position, she kind of tried to discredit everything I did, right? Granted, all right? Because I was confused. I'm like, damn, you used to say so much great things about me. Now I'm responsible for everything but your success. I'm responsible for verbal abuse, financial abuse, this, that. But when it comes to your success, I have nothing to do with it. Okay, that's strange. But the pregnancy is what. The pregnancy is what really made me realize because I have two kids. I've been into labor rooms. When someone is in labor, it's cool. It's, it's out of the blue. No female is planning to go in labor, right? I have two kids. I know this. You can't tell me otherwise. Krishan planned her labor. She didn't coincidentally go to Baltimore and her water broke and she just went somewhere and had the baby. You know how I know this? Because certain hospitals don't let you film because of their own rules and, you know, whatever they got going on. Krishan went to a place prior when she was on baddies in Baltimore. She found a place prior that she could record this birth at. So, stay with me. Mm -hmm. It's all attention based. Mm -hmm. Krishan has done everything up to this far mm -hmm. for attention. She's manipulating all of us. Mm -hmm. And the only reason I'm now waking up and realizing it because I have kids, so I know how this situation goes. So now that mm -hmm. two and two don't aren't going together, mm -hmm. it makes sense. Right? Mm -hmm. Krishan flew to Baltimore with a hospital that she already knew she could film at. She flew there medically induced. She let us know mm -hmm. before the baby was coming that it was coming. Mm -hmm. Four weeks before the due date. Mm -hmm. Right? So if your due date is September 23rd, mm -hmm. why are you letting us know that the baby is coming a week before? A week before September. You let in us know in August. How do you know that? This is your first child. You're inexperienced. Okay. I get it. 
another thing. See, it, she knows that it's gonna be a big, a big deal. For example, why do you think before Krishan goes live and she cries and says that I'm a terrible guy? Her makeup's done, her jewelry's on, her nails are done. Everything is pre-planned. That's the genius part about it. Her fame, her claim to fame is sympathy. And who's going to deny that? If it's evident, if it's in her face. Right? That's the manipulation. So now I'm like, damn, I didn't let this bitch give me. Man, I'm disappointed in myself. I take that thing. I'm a real nigga. past your due date so they had to break your water you couldn't have planned for something like that right how many kids you got <laughs> fuck that bitch got us baby she got us she got you <laughs> i'm good But now that I think about it, the baby ain't got my name. I ain't signed no paper. She had the baby in Baltimore. It's not in California, so there's no. I'm schoolyard. I'm good. Dead homies. <laughs> oh, the dead homies. The bitch planned it out so much for herself, selfishly inclined, that she didn't even take into consideration. The laws. <laughs>